Hey guys, Paul from I Dry Needle. Just gonna run through a quick how to use the Pointer Excel LT. This is the only handheld unit. Um, not everyone trained with it, so let's run through some of the basics. We essentially have two metal contacts, which means we can either do a metal to metal contact on two needles, or we can ground the bar and stem one needle. Otherwise, we have to maintain depression of the trigger switch. And with our contact, we will slowly increase intensity. So we have our voltage, our trigger switch, the polarity switch, and lastly, our frequency. So our pulse rate in Hertz. So first, let me just demonstrate, I have two needles in the medial and lateral gastroc. So I'll do a metal to metal contact so your needles that have a metal handle, you can conduct through the handle. Otherwise, you'd have to conduct through the shaft. So metal to metal contact, metal to metal contact. That scratchy sound is actually telling me that I am not fully depressing that trigger. So metal to metal contact, holding the trigger, I will now slowly increase the intensity until we have achieved a motor response. From there, it's based primarily on patient comfort. Probably the biggest confusion though, is if I only have one indwelling needle, that requires me to somehow ground that bar on the patient. So here I'll just give a firm compression. I would recommend grounding on soft tissue. So not a bony prominence. We obviously can't conduct through clothing and that sort of thing. So I'll just ground the bar superiorly, metal to metal contact, and now a single needle stem using the pointer excel so that's helpful not only for proper use but also to troubleshoot if your unit isn't working properly